Hey, friends and fans, welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. Glad to see you guys here. We're always bringing you guys the latest tech, and today we've got two products from the people over at Corsair. Now, these are their Raptor series of headphones. We've got two of them behind me, the HS30 and the HS40. Now, the HS30, these are coming to market at about $49. They have 3.5 millimeter inputs, and they're only just 2.1 stereo headphones, but they're only $49. The ones above them, the HS40, they are based on USB, so you don't need a sound card or anything like that. You just plug them in, and they are 7.1, but they're also $79. They're a little bit more pricey. Now, these both have microphones on them. They're actually noise cancellation microphones. There are 40 millimeter drivers on the headphones. There's supposed to be noise cancellation on those as well. They're nice and padded. Um, beyond that, they're pretty well priced, and they're geared for the gamer, hence, you know, like the Raptor name. So with that said, let's jump in. Let's take a look at them. All right, folks, so I don't really know. Is this an unboxing? I guess it is a clear little plastic box. We've got a little piece of tape up here on the top right here. So there I go. I made a nice cut there. Probably not the actual best uh, cutting job ever there. I kind of cut the plastic, but it's working. So I guess there's more all around the side here. So let's go ahead and remove that. I guess the scissors were a little bit overkill. Maybe I didn't really need them. I could have just, I guess, popped this tape off of there. So there we go. The big plastic box. These are, you guys can see, the 530s. So I'll go ahead and now that I've uh, done all that destructive plastic stuff, just like a good unboxing of a case, I'll just take them and roll them out there. Look at that, they roll out nice and simply onto there. All right, so here's what they look like outside of the plastic. Looking nice, got the name right there. Got the flippy folding microphone. Spin those around again, so you guys can see all that. That's pretty much the packaging. So remember, like I said, there's really not too much difference between this and the other one, except for the 7.1 and the connectivity. Beyond that, they have a lot of the exact same features. So, oh boy. I love unboxing headphones because uh, once you take them out of the box, I mean, that's pretty much it. There's like no way to like really get headphones out of a box in any kind of super nice and neatly order. Every one I've ever got so requires some kind of like, you know, ripping and tearing or smashing. Well, maybe not the smashing part, but at least the ripping and tearing part. That's in all fairness, a, a given. So here we go. We'll pop these out. Got some paperwork inside of here. They, whoa, they're trying to roll off on me there. Don't go rolling anywhere. Whoa, look at that. They roly poly. All right, so here we go. The warranty guide. We'll get that out of the way and go back to our little roly poly headphones. And after that, I'll be able to pull these little things out of here. There's a couple little slits here. So we'll pull those bad boys out of there. I don't know what else is in here. This just says, uh, this just says, for any of my Chinese friends out there, uh, please translate. This says, what? Please leave your comment down below. Thank you. Well, nothing else in the box. Wait, yep. Warranty against defects. Notification for Australian consumers. Ah, so if you're living the land down under and you're an Australian and you want to throw the shrimp on the barbie, You've got the problem. <laughs> Probably not my best Australian accent, but what the hell, I'm giving it a go as we rumble. All right, so here we go. The units themselves, all bagged up in a nice little plastic bag here. I'll continue to try to, uh, yeah, go ahead and cut this up, I guess, even though this is lovely. I don't know why they do this, because, you know, putting a bunch of tough plastic on here that you gotta rip through, you got a cable, I don't know, it doesn't always seem like the smartest thing to me. Maybe that they should just do this a different way. I mean, because look at this. I mean, sure, yeah, I suppose you can try to cut it in there, but either way, then you got to get the scissors up next to your cable. I mean, that could just lead to a mistake. I don't know. There we go. We'll cut that off. Get this all out of there. Kaboom. All right. So take a look right here. Got your headphone and your microphone connection right there. Simple little gold-plated design. Moving down. You can see it's pretty well made. Got another connector coupler here. I'm gonna move down. Here's our controller right here. On and off with volume control. Go ahead and just check these out. Here's the inside. 40 millimeter drivers. Nice, soft. Neoprene, soft stuff there. On the top, completely padded as well. They're pretty flexible as well, as you guys can see. They're not breaking, they're very flexible. They're very lightweight as well. Microphone is adjustable. 
can also move up and down and lock into place. Now I'm going to go ahead and uh, put these on my head. I'll have the camera and, uh, readjust and I'll get back with you in a second here. All right, folks, so I have them on my head. I've had them on a couple minutes here, just shaking my head around, and they are very, very comfortable. I don't really feel me getting any head fatigue on these. I feel no um, spots, you know what I'm talking about, when you're wearing a headphone where a certain spot is uncomfortable or, you know, just, just doesn't feel right. These feel completely fine on my head. The microphone, like I said, is adjustable, so you can get it up by your mouth farther if you want to. If you don't want to use it at all, you just fold it up and out of the way. Um, I don't see this giving the user any fatigue even after hours of wearing. It's pretty, really comfortable and pretty light. All right, folks, so here we have the HS40s. Now, I don't want to tear these out of the box, folks, because to be honest with you, we're planning on giving these all away to you folks for Christmas presents. I don't think a person is going to want the open box. So the only difference to this, though, is it is a 7.1 gaming headset. It plugs in USB, and the part that controls the volume and stuff is slightly different. But beyond that, all the specs are exactly the same as far as the electronic, the engineering, the way they're going to sound is going to be the same. Now, there's 7.1 in this, so you'll have that 7.1 separation, but as far as the quality of the sound, they should be very, very similar. I'm gonna do full reviews on both these products. I'm actually gonna make contact my contact at Corsair and ask him to send me an open box one of these, so that way I can actually take a listen to them without having to destroy the box. All right, tech fans, so there you have it, the HS30 and HS40 coming to market at $49 and $79 respectfully. Now, these things on my head were pretty comfortable. I don't think they're going to cause you any discomfort when wearing them. I'll have to put them on and listen to the sound when you guys can see that in the full review when I talk about that, but this has pretty much been the unboxing first look where we take a look at the product. Now, over here, to my side over here, you guys can see another complete set of headphones. I'll be bringing these guys to you guys next week. You guys are all into headphones. I know that. So those guys were happy enough to provide us with a bunch of different stuff for you guys to get a taste of. Plus, Christmas is coming up. So guess what we're going to be doing with all these things? That's right. We're going to be giving them to you people. That's right. Early Merry Christmas. That's right. Anyways, if you guys are interested in buying these headphones or want to see more information, click out the link down there below in the description. We'll have all that stuff there for you. If you like the video, hit that like button. If you're not subscribed and you like what you see, then hey, go ahead and hit that sub button. I'm Elric. I'll see you guys back here on Tech of Tomorrow for more tech goodness.